Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Town B is back with another one. All right. You know, Lisa Leslie. Shout out to Lisa Leslie. Shout out to Stevie Jackson. Stevie Jackson, um, very compassionate man, spoke out on his friend George Floyd. At the end of the day, and I'm going to get on a lot of these YouTubers too, who taking a tragedy to try to sit up here and, you know, push an agenda that really don't mean nothing right now. Okay? That really don't mean nothing. Because like I said, I'm finna get on everybody. Like I said, everybody gonna get it. And I'm gonna call out names. I ain't worried about none of that shit. Okay? Real talk. Now, let me get to let me get to Jason Whitlock. You know, Jason Whitlock has long been suspected of being moist. And a lot of people have hinted that about him. But, you know, that's his business. And he has that mentality. But Jason Whitlock is showing that he a cloud chaser. And to a certain degree, he comes across that his obsession, his obsession with certain people comes across more as having a man crush or a homosexual crush now you have dozens of athletes that have spoke up not just not just black white hispanic jj watt a couple of other people and said that was deplorable and said it was disgusting one football player said, said, I'm ashamed to be white. He said, don't nobody deserve that. And props to him. Because at the end of the day, if you got any type of heart, it, I, I mean, for you to say that somebody deserved to die and have somebody take their life away in the open, being filmed, and you seeing a dude enjoying it. But see, here's the thing. That cop, he ain't man enough to go to George Floyd's old neighborhood with no gun and no badge and go face his family like a man. See, he too chicken shit to do. He would never do that. Because he ain't a real one. He a fake one. But let me get back to Jason Whitlock. I'm going to just make this very clear. This is just an honest to God truth. I'm going to keep it 100. If you support Jason Whitlock. On anything he does. If you are a supporter of Jason Whitlock. And if you support people that support him. And try to protect him. Whatever the case may be. Please unsubscribe to my channel. You got to pick a side. I, I I can't do the sauce sh uh, shoeing shit because at the end of the day, why should Jason Whitlock get protection? Because people trying to protect Jason Whitlock because they trying to push an agenda which they trying to call themselves building up their own club. Look who I talked to. Look who I've done interviews with. Like talk like. Talking to Jason Whitlock is a great thing. A dude who, who, on numerous occasions, has attacked the black community and said heinous things about the black community. But yet you got people who said nothing near as worse as Jason Whitlock, but somehow you got people trying to turn other people against him and trying to play the race up against each other for Jason Whitlock a nobody a nothingless man so I'm, I'm keeping it 100 people can take it however they want you support Jason Whitlock get the hell off my channel unsubscribe to me he get protected you can't say what you want to say to him but then you can say and talk about other people I told you, man, at the end of the day, man, you got to watch out for certain people, man. 
Cause they don't be, they don't. It ain't about the race. It's about them. So I'm, I'm telling you right now, man. Pick a side. If you support Jason Whitlock in any kind of way, and see, I'm, a, I'm gonna tell you something. I didn't see people come on my channel and say, yeah, man, f Jason Whitlock, J f Jason Whitlock. He ain't shit. He ain't nothing. He ain't nothing. But then you'll see him on another platform, and then you sit there. Oh, I got, I got a newfound respect for Jason Whitlock. Why? Don't be wishy-washy. And I know who y'all are too. And I'm serious. Just because I don't comment on other channels and other outlets, don't mean I don't be watching. So I'm telling you right now. If you support Jason Whitlock, for real. If you a fan of Jason Whitlock, then that means you an enemy of mine. And that means you can't be trusted. Please unsubscribe to my channel. Take your ass to the channels that sit up and protect Jason Whitlock. That don't that don't deserve to be respected. I'm keeping it 100. People got to pick a side, man. I ain't going for this inconsistent blackness shit no more. For real, you can't pick and choose when you want to be black, and then all of this, uh, all of a sudden you want to be politically correct. You got to stay on one side of the fence. This man, Jason Whitlock, constantly harasses LeBron James. But he don't say nothing about the other people. He questions LeBron James' sincerity. He always got something to say about LeBron James. He accuses LeBron James of trying to take away clout from Michael Jordan, who, by the way, has not said absolutely shit, but he MJ. And, that, you know, at the end of the day, I'm going to make this quick. I, I really pray for Michael Jordan, and I'm serious. I'm going to pray for Michael Jordan on this on, on this part, that maybe Michael Jordan would just put business and his image aside to worry about what's going on with us. He's not obligated, but I wish he would do it. So I'm going to leave it at that. But Jason Fit Fatlock, Jason Porkchop don't deserve our respect. We owe Jason Whitlock absolutely nothing. Look at his history. But then he getting getting protected. Nobody can't say nothing to him. We got to watch what we say to, to Jason Whitlock. Man, please. At the end of the day, you have the right to question Jason Whitlock. Nobody ain't got to respect that that fat boy, please. But like I said, people that have said lesser things, all of a sudden they ostracized. What's J Jason Whitlock excuse? Like I said, Jason Whitlock, he he he's he he real suspect. I'm just keeping it 100. And I mean every word I say. If you support Jason Whitlock, get off my channel. I am serious. Unsubscribe. Please. Unsubscribe. Because I can't trust you. That's real talk. This your boy, Town Biz. I'm out.